This video demonstrates how to enter feed deliveries into stock for your holding. A previous video dem demonstrated how to enter and submit a sample antibiotic data entry. To recap, from PigHub, select the corporate, agent or producer icon and click on the EMB link at the bottom right hand side of the screen. This logs you onto EMB. Let's click continue. And from here, select the holding you want to work on. In this case, Perky Pink Pigs 3. And select click here to start entering data. Delivering feed into stock will populate the, the feed drop down lists in simple antibiotic or the medicine book data entry methods. Note that you can avoid this, the process of booking in feed in stock by entering the amount of medicine product contained in the feed as described in the previous video. It's also worth noting that there is no need to enter stock deliveries when using any of the Excel templates. This time we'll choose the simple antibiotic data entry and select the time period for which you will be entering data. We'll choose the current quarter, confirming where necessary. And then select the total amount of antibiotic used. At this point, even though you haven't yet entered any data, EMB has created a draft submission for you. You can now choose either to add the antibiotic product or the feed in stock. Currently, there is nothing listed in the feed in stock drop down list. So if you want to enter feed stock, you will need to enter a feed delivery. And to start this off, cancel and return to the dashboard. And now select my feed stock on the right hand side of the page. Select add a new feed product. And in the pop up window, enter the name of the feed stock. We will enter linker mix 44. One kilogram per ton. Make sure this description accurately identifies the premix and, where necessary, the concentration. Now choose the medicine product from the drop down list. Click, click on the drop down list arrow and begin to type in Lincosin. It makes it easy to select Lincosin premix 44 gram per kilogram from the list. We'll specify a concentration of one kilogram per ton. Be careful entering the concentration. You need to enter the concentration of the medicine product in the feed, not the concentration of the active ingredient. If you are in any doubt about the concentration of medicine in your premix, your feed supplier will help you. And if you're happy, select add and confirm that you wish to record a delivery in the pop-up window. A further pop-up window asks, asks you for the delivery details. In this case, two tons have been delivered today with an order reference number of 12345. Select OK. We've entered only one feed stock item, so you will need to repeat this process for each food product. Now you are ready to enter antibiotic usage using the feedstock you have just set up and delivered. So when you enter data on the right hand side of the screen, EMB takes you back to the draft return you created earlier. And select continue and select add total amount of antibiotic used. The feed will now be displayed in the feed in stock drop down list as follows. For age group, select finisher in this example. Choose the appropriate unit of measure, in this case tons. And enter the total units used, in this case one. In this instance, we will choose scour as the primary reason for treatment. If I click S, it will take me straight to it. And select save. Now carry on in this way until all antibiotic usage data has been entered, at which point you can submit the antibiotic usage return. 
And just as in the previous video, we will select the holding category, in this case, finisher. Number of sows and balls is zero. The number of finishers that have left the holding is 100. The number of wieners that have been moved off the holding is zero. If you have any further questions, the contact details can be found on contact HDB pork. Otherwise, submit the return. You will then receive a confirmation message. Thank you for listening.